Today is Queen Charge Law, channel 11, 12, 13, and 14. I'm currently searching right now to find the base, but I'm gonna be as detailed as possible and break it down to teach you how to do it. You always want to charge into the enemy queen and take her out, but you also want to think about the defensive clan castle. But since the clan castle is far to the edge, what we can do is drop a few balloons to try to pull it out. Drop the queen up top because the enemy queen's up here. Drop one balloon in front of the queen and then all your healers like so. Now let's drop another balloon down here to test for uh, defensive clan castle. There doesn't look like there's any. Other than there's there's a lot of hounded ice going, we can't pull it out because balloons don't pull that out. So now let's take a look at this queen, right? So this queen is gonna make her way through here. If you saw my previous one of my previous videos where the Blizzard Lalo guide, hold on, let me go and rage this queen up while I'm talking here, is you want to take out a chunk of the base. So for example, let's say say we take out this chunk. Let me drop a wall breaker so we can break this queen into here. If we take out this chunk of the base like this with the queen. Now, we can use the Lalo to either come this way or we can come this way. It looks like the queen's running a little bit this way more through here. We can, we don't have any headhunters, but we can drop another raid for the queen here. And so it looks like the queen's actually going to go this way. So that means our king could actually come here to clear this. So let's go ahead and use the king now so he can grab this. And then our Lalo can come around the base like so to move through here. But you have to keep an eye, eye on the defensive eagle. And when do you start your Lalo? Right around about a minute 45. So are we at that mark? Let's drop a wizard here. Let's go and drop a stone. Oh, queen's going for that. Okay, so the single locks onto the queen. And let's drop a stone slammer like this. Go and rage this queen up. Freeze that. Pop king ability. And now start the balloon. So the stone slammer will act like a lava hound, essentially. So we'll drop another hound down here as we move our way with the warden. Drop some minions, because if you don't drop your minion time, you're going to time fail. As we continue our way through, let's go and freeze you. Some more balloons as we continue our way through. But notice I don't drop all my balloons in a line, right? They're going around the space slowly together. And then what you can do, I'll talk about it when we get to tunnel 12, try to pop the warden ability to protect a lava hound. And then when you have headhunters, when you use the headhunters to go through for another defensive hero of either the royal champion or the enemy queen one of those two and you want your queen charge essentially to take out one of those so think about it like a circle oh i forgot one building up there but in terms of this we have a circle that's like that the queen took out essentially all of all of this here and then the king took out all this and then the lalo is responsible for the rest of the base to move around right here. This is Town Hall 11 and Town Hall 12. Sometimes I like to take a jump spell, which is nice. So we'll try to use that. And then we'll continue to use the other Town Halls here. And be sure to let me know what attack strategy you guys love seeing next. For this Town Hall 12, notice we have some headhunters here. So we have an option of charging into the clan castle or the enemy queen. Let's go to the clan castle and act like it might have some troops in it. So we'll tr charge our way through here. And then, so first, Let's get the queen down, drop a balloon, drop the healers, and then we'll charge the queen. So we'll break the wall here. So if we draw draw a circle like this, right? So the queen is gonna be responsible for essentially charging right through here because I can then wall break again. And then my jump spell will give my queen access in towards here as I can charge her just like this. So hold on, let me make sure I get this rage so I don't lose that queen. I can then get another wall break just like this and open this compartment here. So, all right, looks like there's no defensive clan castle. So now when you start the Lala, we could start the Lala moving this way or we could start the Lala moving this way. But what we probably want to do is start the Lala this way because then headhunters can directly target the enemy queen, right? That's the goal of what we want to do. So let's drop a baby dragon over here. Looks like there's a Tesla. So maybe if I drop two balloons here and we have a stone slammer, I could change it to a flame flinger. Uh, we have expos in the corners and no, I'll just stick with a stone slammer here and we will continue to rage this queen right on up. I don't drop the rage over here. I drop the rage right here so that the queen can walk into it, right? That's the key, walking into the rage spell. I'm gonna drop the jump right about, we have a sweeper, this is a minute 45. So we, we can still reach the town hall from this outside. Let's drop a minion here, which won't, queen will be able to get that. Minute 39. And from the angle of where the queen's going, uh, I don't know. I feel like I gotta start. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna start the Lala from this side. So let's see what happens. We're gonna drop the stone slammer here. 
queen will take 10 jumps. So the reason why is because the queen's making her way to the left anyways. So let's drop a uh, lava hound here, lava hound here, or balloons, balloons, balloons. But let's see this. So if I go ahead and free... No, we're still... Wait, I still have my king. Uh, what am I doing? Let me just drop my king over here. Drop some balloons, 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 warden, and then this is the headhunter. Right, the headhunter needs the angle directly for the enemy queen. Because if you don't, what happens is if I drop my warden like this with headhunters into the king, then they will get stuck on the king. I need them to go directly for the enemy queen. When you pop that warden ability, you, what you want to do is protect the lava hound. Uh, you also want to protect... Let me just get rid of these spells here. You want to protect the lava hound. You want to protect the headhunters when you move your way through. The most ideal scenario would have been for the queen to be over here. And since my queen was pathing this way anyways, I didn't want to take out these buildings, which the queen was going to get on her path that way. So you got to start to think about where's the queen going? You don't want to take out buildings that the queen is going to be responsible for. Because if you do, then you're kind of wasting her value as we're getting this for the town 12. So town 13 here with that town hall kind of in the core. We don't have a stone. We do have a log launcher, so we could go with that to get access to the town hall. Do I have any chance of getting to the town hall with my queen to reach over? Doesn't look like it. So I'm gonna try to get the queen to go for the town hall. So, but notice if I charge my queen to the enemy queen, I can grab the eagle and the queen. That's a lot of value, but I can pull the uh, clan castle with some balloons. So let's go ahead and drop the queen here right there and i'm gonna drop the king here and wall break oh the, there's an open wall so the wall break's gonna go a little awkward let's drop the healers have a wall break here all right so the king now since the king's gonna get locked down to by the single target in front of a little rage drop a headhunter okay okay so king we'll just drop the royal champ here as well all right so as we continue our way through we're gonna freeze you pop king ability let's go two balloons like this Take out this cannon and drop an archer and then the log launcher will go here the log launcher will be responsible for getting access to the town hall so that's the whole point otherwise i don't have a jump spell this is where a jump spell would, would have been very beneficial oh and i forgot to try to pull a clan castle and usually there's obviously not a cc but now we need to start the lalo this way to force that queen in towards the town hall so let's drop you here Let's drop some more balloons, balloons, and this is the key here. Watch this, right? Freeze the town hall. Headhunters, lava hound. Headhunters and lava hound all together. Pop the warden ability to protect that lava hound as it flies all the way across. If you're able to do that, then the hound will tank so much longer. If you miss it, then it doesn't tank it as long, and it's a big deal. So let's go and rage up these balloons leading into here. Drop the minions down and around. We're leading into the scatter shot. Let's go and freeze you. We can go and rage again. Drop another balloon. Uh, we'll just haste down there, drop some minions, and drop that. So you can see, if I had a jump spell, I would have then tried to get the jump for the queen. But since I didn't have that, I had a log launcher that was cooked up that I can then just switch to, right? I could have just sent a stone slammer, but I needed a way to take the town hall down. And you want to try your best to take out the, the town hall with your queen charge if possible. But you can see how I charged the queen into here. The king was used as a funnel to kind of get the queen into that section. And then we lolloed around the lolo, helped then force the queen potentially back around. Remember that warden in Charles home. Where is the queen? She's down south. Eagle is down there as well. The town halls all the way over here. So if I take a look at a circle very quick and I try to charge what my queen into here, then that leaves the town hall. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to charge my queen and grab the town hall. And then I'm just going to react and see where the queen goes. So I'm just going to drop the queen here. Let's see what happens. So the queen... We'll walk away and we got a lot of free spells. So I'm not worried about if the queen's walking into the town hall with a single target infernal behind her. So she's going to be walking this way. Okay. Drop a boom because we always send the king for the town hall potentially. So the queen's going into here. And drop the healers onto you or right through here. All right. So queen's stepping into like this. There's a lot of openings in these walls here, which is... I'm going to drop a baby dragon. Oh, hello, Teslas. We're going to continue this queen. Drop a rage like this. Okay. So let's drop. Uh, there's the going for the storage. All right. Let's go for the king here. Two balloons to kind of push this king to the town hall, I guess, at this point. All right. As they continue their way around. So king is going towards there. Queen's continuing her path in. 
All right, let's continue. Let's rage this queen leading up into the enemy queen. We'll freeze the town hall in the single. There we go. So we're going to take that down. And then we can allow from the top side so we don't have to worry about time. So we'll uh, pop king ability. That will go down. He'll run up and around. We'll drop, the, uh, royal, we'll drop an ice golem over here. Royal champion like this. We'll just continue this queen to charge our way through. Drop a wizard. Let's drop a stone slammer to move through here. As the RC moves around, queen's continuing. We can try to wall break. Try to wall break around. More balloons. Lava hound, balloon, balloon, balloon. A warden. Let's go ahead and uh, freeze that single. That queen's ability is going to be forced. Let's go ahead and freeze you. But here goes the headhunters right under the warden. I right, am pop the warden ability protect the balloons. We didn't protect the hound. So as we continue with the balloons around, dropping the minion just like this. We can drop, drop some haste. We can drop some freezes. And there we go. So the queen did not go for the tunnel, but that's fine. Just send the king in there. He was able to secure it. No worries. All these openings in the wall definitely allow the queen to walk in and out. At this point, you just don't know where the queen's going to go with all those openings. So at that point, you just let the queen go. And if she goes to the town hall, great. If she walks to the bottom side, have a plan for it. The king can do it. Use uh, If you have a couple freezes, it can make a big difference, especially through single target infernos. And hopefully, these hits helped you in your queen charge lalas.